In this video, we show you how to customise your home screen on the Sony Xperia S. Now, there are many options when it comes to home screen customization. You'll notice that you probably have a multitude of home screens on the Xperia S. So let's run through some of the basic configuration settings. You can tap and hold on the home screen to access this personalization menu where you have the ability to add widgets, applications, folders, shortcuts, wallpapers and themes. You can also get some of these similar settings by tapping the menu button and choosing one of the options below, whether it be the theme, the wallpaper or tapping add and you get to this personalization menu again. You can check out videos on our YouTube channel regarding the wallpaper and the themes, but let's show you some of the main configuration settings that people will do when it comes to their home screen. So you press and hold, and you may like to add a particular widget to your home screen. Now the widgets open to you will depend on your configuration and some of the applications that you have installed on your device. But there are a whole multitude here, and we'll just show you one for example's sake. So, I may wish to choose to add a calendar. So what it's actually come and told me is that on this screen I had no space because I've already got some widgets here, but the new widget I wish to add is too big. So I could look to my other screens to see if there is a widget or space. So to create some space, what I can do on any of the home screens is to tap and you see how this now is floating about, but I have this bin icon at the bottom. I can drag that and it goes red. That means the element you're holding will now be placed in the bin if you let go. So there, and it's gone into the bin. I can do the same again and I've moved it to the bin. So if I now press and hold on the screen and click widgets and click calendar, so you'll see that it's added it to my screen and I can drag it about like so. I can go back to another screen, I can remove a widget as I did before or a shortcut. I can even drag this widget across to a different screen like so. So let's say I want it on my main home screen, I can pop that there. I can press and hold again and I can add a shortcut to an application, so my alarm. I can move that about as I choose and you can see with applications you could have a whole screen full of application shortcuts. I may want to organize these so I may create a folder so I now have a folder in there and I can drag applications to that folder. I can then move the folder about I can tap on the folder to open it, I can drag things out of it or back into it, I can drag things from the menu here into that, I could then drag the alarm down into the bottom bar here if I chose, I can press and hold on the screen again and I can add different shortcuts so Let's go to Astro and it's given me a different sort of setup here so I can click that and click that. I can have a shortcut to a particular image there if I chose. I can then go and change my wallpapers from here. So there's lots of different options as to what you can do for customizing your home screen on a Sony Xperia S and the options are really endless. So the key is just to play around and get a setting and setup that you like, adding and removing different widgets. The main way of accessing that is by pressing and holding on your home screen.